awesome. Have some fun out there. We'll see you back in just a little while, everybody. Enjoy yourself. Hey, remember, if you don't ever run or you don't ever go out for walking and exercise, one foot in front of the other. That's all it takes. Just keep, just keep going. One foot in front of the other, and you will make it to that finish line. We'll be here to cheer you on every single step of the way. Have a great time, everyone. That's from Electric Ocean. So they have the Christmas trees on the race course. The first mile is going to be the parking lot. That's the main entrance to the parking lot. We just reached mile marker one. Still in the parking lot. Look at that sunrise though. So pretty. We've officially made it inside the park. We're close to mile two now. Look at that sunrise. searching for animals that are in trouble. Recognizing that there's an animal in trouble is the first step in any rescue. Not knowing, you don't know to rescue the animal, but seeing that an animal's in trouble is the first step, and that's what all of you guys do. Whether you're in your house looking out the window seeing a bird that looks like it can't fly, or whether you're out on the waterways and you see a manatee that looks like they might be struggling because they've been hit by a boat. Reporting those injuries is the first step in the rescue process. The way you can do that is by dialing pound FWC on any cell cellular device. Here in the state of Florida, that will get you in touch with Florida Wildlife Commission. It's a green sea turtle <laughs> who was rescued in 2018. Um, due to the shell injury, you guys can kind of see on the back half of the shell there. Uh, we don't know exactly what happened. Could have been a boat strike, maybe a shark bite, but whatever it was caused some air to be trapped um, along his spinal column. So that's why he's floating at the, sur uh, the surface of the water like that. Um, so our veterinarians have tried so since this was the first ever rescue run, it's also going on on the rescue weekend. So they have tons of fun events. They have a little guide. And this weekend is also the Jack Hanna weekend. So you have the rescue weekend and Jack Hanna and the race on the same day, which is pretty cool to do all this in one day. So that was my look at the Inside Look Weekend and also the Rescue Run is the first ever one. I am really excited to do it again. In May, they also have a Furry Friends Run for Sesame Street and I'm really excited to participate soon. I will be having more SeaWorld videos and more 5 and 10K videos, so make sure you subscribe below to see all SeaWorld and races in Orlando.